and to details. President Abdel Fattah Sisi attended on Wednesday differently able celebration for supporting people with special needs. Under the slogan, We Have a Place, the ceremony was held at Al Manara Conference Center in New Cairo. In remarks during the ceremony, President El Sisi praised the nation's martyrs, calling on all Egyptians to protect the country and keep working for a better future. The president said the state is performing its duties and should bring responsibilities towards all its citizens, adding that the state depends on laws and regulations in the administration of its institutions. President El Sisi also thanked all families of the people with special needs for their efforts and sacrifices, a documentary on achievements made during the last three years of providing special services for people with special needs in Egypt was featured during their ceremony. Wrapping up the remarkable event, President El Sisi took memorial photos with several people with special needs attending their ceremony. Meanwhile, Minister of Youth and Sports Ashraf Subhi addressed the ceremony saying the state attaches top priority to the people with special needs, adding that the ministry adopted 50 projects directed to them. Minister of Social Solidarity Niveen al qabbaj also said Egypt made great progress in protecting the rights of people with special needs despite the crisis rocking the world. Minister of Interior Mahmoud Tawfiq announced the acceptance of new batch in the police academy for the academic year 2022-2023. During a press conference held at the police academy headquarters, the criteria of accepting newcomers was announced, characterized by objectivity, with the aim of selecting the best and distinguished elements among applicants. The applicants underwent physical, scientific, medical and cultural tests to be qualified for the police academy. With the help of the latest technological means, the total number of applicants coming from all governorates nationwide has reached 50,752.